Hello, it's Mark Matosh here for Markham 3D, and today I'm going to show you how to set up in-game ads for Unreal Engine. You can place these in VR, AR, mobile games, PC games, whatever. Let's go through it really quick using the AdMix system. Here we are at admix.in. Let's log in or create account if you need to. From here, let's come over into the download section and this download option will be enabled very soon. Once you've downloaded the plugin, go to Unreal Engine UE 4.23 or whatever version you have, just make sure you've downloaded the corresponding version. We're gonna go Engine, Plugins, and I'm just gonna copy and paste it into here. And here it is now in our Plugins folder. Let's launch Unreal. Now I'm just using the first person example template I'm gonna go edit, plugins, and at the top here we've got advertising, admix enabled. At the moment you get a warning, you might, you might not, but let's click yes. And now we have to restart our projects. So let's do that really quick. And now it is enabled. So let's now close this window and at the top here we've got admix. Now put in your logon details that you put into the admix website. And once you've put in your credentials, hit login. And now we're logged in. Start creating placements. What we can do here is we can add in various size banners. So let's go six, five, and we'll I'll add in this one by two. Don't close this window, just minimize it. Because if we're closing it, then it's kind of logging us out. So we have to leave it open. And if we come here, there we go. So now we can kind of place it on the walls. Let's just reset the rotations. And quickly, let's just put this back into place. Whoops, it's the wrong way around. 180 on here. This is the same, zero, zero, minus 180. And let's just get rid of this box because we don't need it. So these are gonna be our ads. These are what's gonna be placed. Now that they're placed in our scene, let's come back into this window. We're gonna export OBJ and save placement. We'll select save selected. Would you like to export the materials as images? Yes. Now let's minimize this again. If I were to press play, we'll see we've got these circles thinking. We actually need to go back to admix and do a few things. So I'm just gonna press escape and let's bring up our web page again. Now we've got our project here, which is FPS testing. What we need to do is come into sandbox and we need to turn that on. So obviously sandbox is when we're building the levels um, so we can test what we see. Come over here and select the options or the manager placements. And now you can see that we've got the two banners that we've put in. Now, because we're in sandbox mode, we can come to the status and enable both of these, turn these live. And in the categories, we can actually choose what kind of ads we want to put in. So food and drink and desserts. And for this one, let's just go pets because everyone loves pets. Kind of, sorry, not really. Cats, beautiful. And that's now saved. Let's go back to Unreal. And now the first time we play this, we might actually have to leave it going for about five minutes just for that connection to sync up. It took a little bit longer than five minutes, but here we are. We've got our ads. Um, this is just our template. But obviously if you wanna go live, we come back to the AdMix website click live and there you go. If you found this interesting, please leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about it. If this is something that you see yourself using, leave a comment, let me know. I'm really intrigued to see how many people would love to use this. Please make sure you also hit the subscribe button. It really helps me out and keeps you up to date with my content.